Hey everybody, uh, thank you so much for joining us. It's time for Friday Night Dungeons and Dragons. Woo! Woo! Yay! Yeah. This is a very special Comic-Con edition of Friday Night Saving Throw <laughs> Show. Why is that? Because Comic-Con has stolen all of our regular players. Yeah. Well, almost all of our regular <laughs> players. Uh, so we have <laughs> several <laughs> guests sitting in tonight. Let's start directly to my right with Mr. David Cranon. Where would nerds know you from, David? Uh, you might know <laughs> me from the podcast Crit Juice. What's Yay! That? Crit Juice. What could that possibly be about? That's our uh, Dungeons and Dragons and drinking podcast, where uh, it's like a bunch of funny improvisers, and we get together. And they all play D&D, and I'm the GM on that show, so I have a lot of Don't fellow... touch the t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> shame point! Boom! No! Right now, yeah. mark it no. down. What already happened. Shame point. Oh well, in, 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 uh, in Crit Juice, we established that shame damage can't ever be healed. So that's rough. <laughs> in oh. my game, shame damage gets you kicked off the table. Right. Oh, fuck. All right. <laughs> I've got that It happened up. last week. It did. I actually... Oh, no. I, re I saw the tweets about it, but I don't know what it means. Somebody had to buy him back in. <laughs> Well, uh, to so David's sad. right is Tracy King! Yay! Yay! You may know Tracy from such shows as... Mm -hmm. Tokosu Squad at Twin Galaxies Live. Yeah. Yay! Yay! Uh, uh, <laughs> filling in for... Uh, Sean. I don't know, Sean. Oh, yeah, oh, I'm the new Sean. Sean Graham <laughs> oh is that a shame All point? Right, trying to... Uh, <laughs> Trying to up his fetish quota. Let me be clear. <laughs> okay. Let me just. That's really you, good. I don't know. That's Sean. <laughs> if you really committed, you would have shaved down to the mustache. Oh, God. Okay. Maybe during the break. No, you better yeah. ask your wife. On, on camera. I'm only going to have it for the rest of the evening. I think I totally could. Anyway. Okay. I can, oh, I could do it on camera. Do it we on should camera. raise that as a donation. Shave me down. <laughs> For real? If we get if we get fifty bucks in the tip jar, 50? We'll sh yes, we're gonna shave you down to a gross pedo mustache. Just like <laughs> 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 Wait, Tyler, yeah. is that for real? For, yeah, I have a for mustache. For, for, I'm gonna shave it off. For forty bucks, we'll do the Fu Manchu. Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah. Somewhat respectable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You but we gotta get to the public. full fifty if you want the real, like, <laughs> like amazing. finely, oh, I'm finely into tuned it. creeper oh. mustache that Sean oh, rocks all the time. Mustache. Creeper oh. mustache. Creeper mustache. Creeper mustache. Fetish mustache. Yeah. mustache. It's, it's, mustache. It's, that, it's that mustache that Robin Williams had in one hour photo. It's oh yeah. Definitely. Oh guys, good look. guys, guys, remember Robin Williams? Oh. oh. Remember how he died? I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> I, know, I, know. I didn't meet the evening, and then somehow I, I did. to accomplish it. Uh, to my direct left, with the big mouth, is Amy Verpal. Hey. 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 You I may recognize it. Amy from such nerd shows as uh, BuzzFeed. <laughs> <laughs> it's a site a lot of nerds go to. Yeah. Buzzfeed. And really cool people too. <laughs> what? Cool people go to that too? Yeah. Wow, I didn't realize I was leading the pack. Yeah. Uh, anything else that we um, would like to know you from? Maybe you saw her movie, oh, yeah. First oh. Year of My Life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all kinds of stuff. Well, That's sure. it. Cool. That's it. <laughs> the saving throw. That and, and the saving throw we show, saving which throw? you are currently watching. <laughs> hey, and to her left, uh, uh, last but not least, Hi. it's Mirva. <laughs> Yay! Mirva! You may recognize her from her highly personal Instagram that she never posts on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I mean, she posts all the time. You should follow her. I don't have Instagram. I'm nowhere except here. <laughs> uh, that is our group. Uh, thank you for joining us. Uh, are there any other announcements that we have to do today? Gen uh, GM Mace is off. Uh, we are, some of us are going to be at Gen Con in, it's in two and a half weeks, you guys. Two oh. and a half weeks and saving throw is debuting a funny internet video there or it will be on the internet mm -hmm. at gen con it will be on a screen so wow <laughs> yeah they'll be debuting a little video it may eventually make its way to the internet as well yeah eh, we'll see about that one if buzzfeed has anything to do with it <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, Dom Zook, our illustrious uh, producer and master of technical difficulties, uh, whom you currently can't see. Can they see you? Do you have a camera on you? Okay, you can see the outline of his hand. Depressing. Um, <laughs> and he wrote the video. Mr. Dom Zook wrote the video. Yes. So it must be funny. And he yeah. will be at Gen Con holding a panel on saving throws. So if mm -hmm. you'd like to hear about uh, upcoming events, behind the scenes looks at production, that's not just us posting p embarrassing pictures of Tyler's garage. Um, <laughs> anything you would like to know about saving throw show, Saturday at one o'clock. Yes, sir. Am I right? Yep. Uh, check right. your Gen Con, Gen Con schedule. Where, where is it at? Do you remember? You guys aren't going to remember anyhow. Look it up. Saturday at 1 o'clock. Book yourself out. Unless, of course, you're going to watch me sitting in with Monty Cook doing a completely improvised adventure. I will be playing, or rather my nerdy alter ego who talks in a much less bombastic fashion will be sitting in giving the cypher system a whirl uh, with suggestions uh, from the audience being incorporated in real time live into an impromptu improvised Whoa. adventure. Wow, Monty Cook. Uh, yes. I'm yes, impressed. Yes. With Numenera, I'm sure. Exactly. Yes. Wow. Numenera, The Strange, the yeah. forthcoming uh, uh, cypher system rule book, which I'm just waiting to get my paws on. Uh, also, if you're looking for something fun to do <laughs> at Gen Con uh, and you're looking for a Pathfinder game, I am involved with NASCRAG, the National Society of Crazed Gamers, and we run a two-round tournament uh, every year. We have a great set of prizes. The focus is on role-playing, which I hate, puzzle-solving, which I hate, and having fun, which I inflict on you. I don't receive that. I give it out. <laughs> so uh, check out the schedule. We run uh, several qualifying rounds all the way up until Saturday at 1 o'clock. And then Saturday night is the final round. Uh, we have a great set of sponsors on board, including Monty Cook Games, including Green Ronin, including Paizo Incorporated, including Fat Dragon Games. I could go on. <laughs> I'm not going to. You're blowing David's mind. Yes. All the good yes. ones. <laughs> Welcome. That's all the good ones. Welcome <laughs> to the Shrine of Nerdity. Let's dive right in and get a little sweaty, shall we? Yes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Very good. All the things. Very good. Am I missing anything else, Mr. Zook? Would you like to uh, announce anything else? We're all covered. Thank you There's so much for else. joining us. There's nothing else I can think of. Farts. Great. Farts. I have one more thing I'd like to plug. Please. I don't know what the... Is that cool? Yes. And also, do we look up there, or what do we look do? Look at this one. This yeah. One. If you're going to talk alone, you're over here. Okay. Uh, so I, I, do, I do another podcast about the Star Wars RPG which is an awesome system. I love D&D, but I wish it used a different dice system. And I wish to use the Star Wars dice system. Anyway, never tell me the odds. Yeah. Never <laughs> tell me the odds. Find us on Twitter, at NTMTO Podcast. NTMTO. Never tell me the odds. No, all the good Star Wars Twitter mm. handles, everything, are taken. They're no all taken, odds. so that's the best we could do. I can't get Han Solo 52. Yeah, you could me. You could maybe get that. What See? about what about Pope Chewbacca? Follow me. <laughs> at, follow me at, really? at Pope Chewbacca fifty two. <laughs> All of your Star Wars Is that live when you tweeting. Were born, Dungeon Master? Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Shame point. Oh no! Oh, wow. No, that See was a good here. joke. Oh, Should have seen that God. coming. <laughs> How does this work? Hey, let's uh, yeah. let's run it down. <clears throat> And when the Tarask died, the heroes found the soul of the world was imbued within it, and they looked upon their bloody swords, and they wept. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Godsmite, where the powerful have been slain and the weak work to make their escape from a dying world. You are the five blades of Vidar Einbalder, the <laughs> god of the harvest. You are his chosen, oath sworn to do Vidar's divine bidding before the gray snows of oblivion blanket the land. All right, we are playing Dungeons and Dragons 5th edition pretty much stock, except for some house rules. Why? Because I'm the dungeon bastard and I Woo! can't help but fiddle with things. Uh, all right, first of all, uh, let's start with a simple one. Anytime you roll a 20, something cool happens. Yay! Why? Because that's the way it's supposed to work. So anytime you roll a 20, I don't care if you're making a saving throw, an ability check, a uh, perception check, uh, to hit roll. Death um, save. A death save, you name it. Uh, you get to draw, oh boy, I haven't separated my cards. I'm a little bit behind today. You get to draw from a little something I call 
The deck of the dawn trumpet. Yes. Uh, we'll get to Got that your in dawn a trumpet right here. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm not sure what just happened, but I think somebody wants to earn a lot of shame points. <laughs> Wait, I don't know what shame points are. Oh, I'm glad you asked. We're going to get to that. Oh, okay. Similarly, anytime that you roll a one, something bad happens. Okay. Why? Because I'm the dungeon bastard. That's right. Anytime Anytime you roll a one, you will draw from the deck of splintered bone. That is a deck. I got your deck of splintered bone right here. <laughs> <laughs> so much better. So much better than that. <laughs> uh, chat, you can buy tokens that allow the players to draw from either deck. Uh, oh. That they can cash in at or, any time. Or force the players, I, I don't guess. remember what we're putting on that. How much is it to buy is a, a, a five? card? Five. Five bucaroonies gets you to help the party or to hinder the party. I wish I was a better card music uh, card magician, but I'm not. This is the best <laughs> it gets. My skill is all with rolling dice. Uh, so there you go. Finally, as has already been mentioned several times, you have a special stat called shame points. <laughs> Everyone starts with zero, except you two. You have one <laughs> each. <laughs> Anytime that you do something which I consider cowardly, pathetic, or just generally weak sauce, I will issue a shame point. <laughs> you add one to your shame points, and then you must immediately roll your current total or higher on a d20. So as you accumulate Ooh. shame points, uh, it gets progressively tougher and tougher to okay. make that roll. If you fail this roll, you are shamed out of the game and must leave the table because you suck. Oh. It happened last time. <laughs> oh, it did. It really yeah. did. Uh, we, we have we have a uh, we have a donation. Uh, I just want to call out the dungeon bastard, and if you guys wouldn't mind, can you show some fear in your eyes? <gasps> oh. <laughs> God. And maybe sweat yeah. rolling down your brows and choose who you want to faint. Huh? Wait, wait, what? this is a donation, so we have to <laughs> oh, do this? Oh, I was already yeah. doing it. Yeah. This is for James. <laughs> Where's my selfie? <laughs> All right, good. And uh, and who's fainting? Who's fainting? Uh, Virva. Virva's fainting. Virva. Uh, no. no. Oh, yeah. Fair no. from... No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Well done, everybody. Wow. That was scary. All right. Okay. Uh, so, cool donation. Uh, why don't we quick go around the table and you guys can introduce uh, the okay. name of your character oh, and your race class. I just want to also say I know a, a really quick um, magic trick with a card that I can teach if maybe that's a donation, if you anybody wants to learn that. It's pretty fucking cool. How much is that donation? Uh, I'll put it at 10 bucks. I'd like Whoa, wow. it'll take It'll take literally a minute for me to show to show you and teach you. Uh, and it's actually, it'll impress like kids up to probably 14. Sometimes some adults too. Age 14 uh, where people, <laughs> they start figuring it out after 14. Yeah. It'll is impress this, anyone up to age 14. Is this tied to puberty <laughs> somehow? <laughs> Oh, I wish. Oh. Um, uh, okay, cool. Um, I'm. I, wait, I gotta get my voice. Oh I'm, God. I'm Asta. Blade up my fingers. <laughs> I'm a monk. I'm a monk lady. <laughs> Peligrosa. Peligrosa. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I just said danger, danger in Spanish. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Mm. Mm. You're gonna be good at that. Barasusa good at that. <laughs> let's, uh, let's, let's see if we can take it down a notch. <laughs> no. No. That was awesome. <laughs> oh, by the way, David, since you're new, I just have to warn you. Anytime you look at Virva and say her name, she begins <laughs> to get out of control. Dude, that's not true. <laughs> and, she, and she's just paralyzed. <laughs> just uh, missed her character name or her real name? Oh, no, you have to say her real name. She won't recognize her character name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, we gotta run. It's your turn. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
the Russian. My name is Vethor, Blade of Mercy, and I am Paladin, a uh, half-elf noble background. Great. Very good. <laughs> really, really nice. good. Nice. Not, not racist. <laughs> oh, that was excellent. Yeah. Finally. Okay. Uh, Tyler, would you like to go next, or would yeah. you like to tend the chat? Uh, oh, no, oh, I'm, yes. You do both. I'm helping you out, folks. Oh, you're doing too uh, much. No, uh, um, are we, uh, do we have to introduce ourselves with our character voice? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. I am Ozor. Yes! yes! The Blade of Thunder. <laughs> I come from a tribe called the Stone Crabs, but we live in the mountains. Mountain Stone Crabs. <laughs> I have a big hammer. <laughs> I am not of many words. Ooh. Hi, hey, baby, I'm back. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Viglin, Blade of Oak. I'm a mountain dwarf, and I, I like to keep to myself, baby, as you can see why. Because I'm a hermit. Nice. <laughs> but the ladies love Viglin, the dwarf. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. I will be impressed to see how long you can keep that voice up. <laughs> you, you, all, the, all, all night. All night. All night, baby. All night, baby. <laughs> all night, baby. All night, baby. All right. Yeah, baby. Uh, I am the uh, good brand. <laughs> I have a French accent which might be faked by my character if I feel like dropping it later on. <laughs> I am the blade of light. Yes. And, uh, Ooh, yeah. Oh, I here am, we go. Yeah, so, uh, Are you sure you're not German? It sounds like no. It's, we're kind of, we're, we're, no, uh, I mean, we're making our way around no. Europe right now. No, no, no. <laughs> not German. Nine. Not German. Uh, good brand is, yeah, perhaps German, but <laughs> he's, he's rather slight. Uh, he's a human sage who is a, a, how do you say, arcane knight, eldritch knight, yes, and he fights with rapia, oh. and he's a bit slight of build, but he's very cunning, and he uh, he thinks, this group, yeah, let me see what you can do. Oh. He may hang with you, Blade of Light. Blade of Light. Very good, very good. All right, so, uh, as I mentioned, uh, the Tarrasque was slain. Uh, yes. The soul of the we world was pierced, and therefore, people who had the most connection to the soul of the world, i.e., people with more experience, uh, fr froze solid, turned to glass, and shattered. They died. Oh. Um, this, oh process is, <laughs> this process is slowly working its down to the lower organisms, um, and so as fifth level, you are some of the most powerful people in the world right now. Cool. Uh, okay. Yeah. Um, uh, you have been chosen by the god Vidar Einbalder, who is the god of the harvest, to do his bidding, and uh, generally this means uh, save things that he wants saved because he's trying to get you off of this plane before the entire thing collapses. Okay. Is this God of the Harvest like, uh, good God of the Harvest? Like, what's good corn? Or is it like, God of the Harvest of Souls? Don't question the God of, of the, the Harvest. harvest. <laughs> He's got a scythe? Just let it go at that. <laughs> okay. um, it's a little bit of everything. Yes. So I, I can't, uh, I can't, I can't text you because there's no cell phone service in Tyler's garage. Oh, so, great. Uh, or in I, the medieval period. That's terrific. Yeah. You can, we're doing, you we're doing this old school. You can DM me on the tweeters. Okay. I'm going to start doing that. Yeah, until that? then... Until then, though, I, I just want to get these three out of the way really quick. First, okay. one draw from the deck of Splintered Bone for Tyler yes. as the oh. chat's whipping boy. Yes! For what? As the chat's whipping boy. Oh, oh, you're oh the As Sean would say, fuck you guys, motherfuckers! No, no, that's what? the wrong thing to no. do! No, you don't want to do that! Bad. But that's what Sean would do! Sean was exactly doing that. Oh. Would okay, do. let me be clear here. <laughs> I hate all of you. <laughs> yeah, that, you're doing a great you job. You have to throw in... You are garbage people. You, that's right. You are garbage people. <laughs> oh. Is that good? Is that good? I'm just kidding. I love you. Uh oh. Oh, let me know. How, I really want the. I really want the. Oh god. The, the scary oh, 70s dead. mustache. Oh. Okay. He has to eat that. No. no. What? Oh, Can you if he draws a key? Oh, Nine of spades. Nine of. We have a beetle. Hey friend. Oh no, you gotta get that. Hello guys. Oh. Hello. Hello friend. Mm. I am a beetle. And this is my beetle. Uh, you were at disadvantage I on all, all, of this. all wills, wisdom oh. saves. Disadvantage on all oh, wisdom okay? saves. Yes. How about this real quick? As, as suits yeah. a barbarian. That's fine. Yes, exactly. You my wisdom is, is okay, actually. For the rest of the game. Come on, friend. Perhaps. Wow. Uh, uh, next up. 
Uh, next up is uh, um, uh, one second here. It's uh, <coughs> oh, we did that. We did that. Oh, uh, Amy gets a Leroy Jenkins, which Whoa. is which is a bonus action. A bonus action. Oh, yeah. bonus attack! Yeah, baby. Uh, and you have to shout Leroy uh, Jenkins. Mr. Mr. Bastard gets a, a reroll. Yes. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah. That's very good, guys. Where are my? That's from Redirect yeah. Twitch. Um, Campaign just... coins. Oh, Re redirect, yeah. re redirect Twitch. Thank redirect you. Twitch. Thank you, Redirect Twitch. It's All right. Okay. So it's called the Splintered Bone and the Dawn. Dawn Trumpet. Dawn Trumpet, Dawn Dawn Trumpet, Dawn Trumpet and the deck of Splintered Bone. Okay. Yes. Dawn Trumpet. I wrote Dawn Stick. To be safe. Dawn Stick. Wow, the Dawn Stick. Yeah, it sounds. It sounds like a guy's name from a badly written novel. It also sounds like another hey, innuendo. Dawn Stick. <laughs> hey, everybody. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, so, okay, you yeah, got those. Okay. Are you killing that beetle? No, you're free. Go. <laughs> oh, he came back in. Or, or it's he's over yeah, here. He came back he on the candy. table. He flew. He flew no, there so he is. Nah. Well, well, we got another one. Though. We got another one. Yeah, oh, these guys. Busy all night. Just, these guys are a pestilence. <laughs> hey, come here. Come here, dude. All right. All right. So, uh, hey, we're all a team. We're all a group of. You are all a group of adventurers. In fact, two weeks ago, you adventured together. No, it was right there. Okay. We should probably close the door. <laughs> if that's okay. That's fine by me. All right. Yes, he's here. Okay. He's hiding out. Because those guys have been coming all night. Time takes its toll as the world crumbles around you. Two weeks ago, Vidar Einbalder instructed you to enter the fallen city of Marlethiad and summon the great dragon Norix the Dark Death from his slumber. Ah. As your compatriot, Rangvald, worked his ritual magic, you defended the Citadel from the forces of Zaros Glassweaver, narrow, narrowly conjuring forth the dragon before the Drider could wipe you out. Mm -hmm. Zaros spelt with an X or a Z? With an X, yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're a good DM. You know what's up. Um... There was little time for victory celebrations. Rangvald and the Shadow Dragon went off to the west. The God of the Harvest instructed you to journey south over the Horn Peaks and down into the Valley of Salt to seek the phylactery of Raka Viper's Bane. Oh. You stand before Ghoul Shallow Swamp, gripping a faded map you exchanged with a crooked-eyed lizard man for a few spells of healing. <laughs> the swamp reaches up before you, dense, fetid and impenetrable. The main path slopes off gently to the south, while a narrow hunting trail leads northeast into the Fangmire. You stand at the crossroads of fate. Oh, yeah, we do. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Look, there's one for the folks at home. Oh, cool. Oh, that's for Are our side sure? of the table? Sure okay, great. Take that for the go back. Stop and go. So it's like the great and so we're looking for a map. Raka. We're looking for Raka. What do we have? We're looking the, for the phylactery of the Raka, Raka, Raka Viper's Bane. Oh, okay. So one thing you know is that undead are curiously unaffected by the uh, by the collapse of the world soul, since their souls are generally someplace else. A cursed okay. undead. Uh, may I, as we are studying this map, may I make a history check to see if I can think of anything pertinent about our friend? Rock of Vipers Bay. Yes. Very good. Oh. Aha! Yes. Oh, oh. Roll, it, roll it in here. Then. Ah, I see. It's very it's good. 17. 17. Plus my natural saving. Uh, so I don't know what that is. 20 ish. Four. Four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Math. Sometimes it hurts. Do uh, you know that Rock of Vipers Bane uh, transformed himself as into a lich? He was a practitioner of uh, what shall we say? Wild magic. Yay! Yeah. Uh, Very good. Yes. A leech. Yes. So, uh, and we have a couple uh, little donations here. Wow. Okay, great. I take my uh, bonus attack right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, you get a pull from the deck, David. I'm oh, not sure who sure. that was donated Wait, by. Wait, deck of what? Good or bad? The uh, this is uh, Keganus. Oh, Keganus. Just, just pull. It is red! Huh. <laughs> Very good. Uh, uh -huh. a, a six it is in the French. Six of diamonds. Six. If you say six in uh, French, uh, yeah. I'll probably have to <laughs> yeah. slap myself a few times. <laughs> you are immune to ten points of slashing damage. Wow. Oh, so it was the dawn it was uh, the deck of the dawn stick. Trumpet. 
the deck of a dog. Very good. You have to be very fast to touch uh, good brand. Uh, Brands. All right. And uh, Tracy, you get two pulls for two your pulls. excellent Louis Armstrong. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah, <laughs> yeah baby. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, three of hearts. Three of hearts. Three of farts. All right, three you can farts. cash that into heal 2d6 damage. Heal 2d6 damage. Uh, yes. You get two pulls, however. Yes. You get Someone another pull. really likes. Two of diamonds. Two of diamonds. All right, when you cash that in, any enemy within 20 feet who has been wounded takes 2d6 extra damage as their blood catches on fire. <laughs> awesome. Wow. Um, and then finally, uh, as you are standing, you're standing up uh, by the waterfall here, if you want to show our friends at home the map. <coughs> you're standing uh, Can you see that? At, the, at the waterfall to the... I actually have a graphic there. Oh, you've got it, you even got it up? Yeah. Very cool. Uh, wow. And uh, Gudbrand, as you're standing there surveying and kind of reflecting on the history mm. of Rock of Viper's Bane. And combing uh, my beautiful hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're, you're combing it, and, and as you look to your left, you see a little uh, kind of uh, shadowy fae figure come flitting out of the darkness. <laughs> and uh, You're on nearly as... You have to do this. He is nearly as fae as me. Who he lands on your shoulder and he says... <laughs> Would you like to take a pull? Well, I uh, think I'll... Uh, <laughs> oh, yes. Hey, gross! Fortune <laughs> favors the brave, uh-huh. <laughs> yes, very good. A uh, three of diamante. <laughs> okay, oh, you can cash... Oh, you have the diamonds! You can cash oh, this diamonds. card in to cast a six die six fireball. Oh! oh very impressive. This is in, from my enchanted rapier, which I inherited from my father, has many powers. <clears throat> All right, and one of our perennial favorites uh, is joined us again tonight. That person is known as the Space Colonizer. Hey! Yay! I've said it before and I'll say it again. We should colonize space. We should. <laughs> <laughs> we need to colonize space as soon as possible. <laughs> Mars yeah. is the only planet inhabited by robots. Is that true? <laughs> oh. Yeah. More, more robots than humans. That's Science. Right. Uh, nice. Space Colonizer is handing out a free reroll to each of the ladies. Thank you, Space Colonizer. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Qué lindo. Thank you. Gracias. Estás muy Colonizing. bonito. <laughs> <laughs> I said you're very beautiful. I'm giving myself <laughs> a shame <laughs> point. I'm still in the game. Ball. Okay, Ball. he's also giving Ball. each of you a pull from the deck. Oh, oh this is so exciting. Mm -hmm. All right, King of Diamonds. Ooh. King of Diamonds. Ooh. You can cash that in to heal one ally within 30 feet for six die six hit points. Ooh. Wow. Yes, that is very good. Wow. Have I told you how much I like you? Mm -hmm. Not enough! Going to stand for it. <laughs> Keep it coming! Oh, my beautiful! Are you get a draw. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, Queen of Hearts. The Queen of Hearts. Oh, that's a great card. Yeah. You can cash this in to give, uh, so that all allies within 30 feet of you can immediately take the dash action as a reaction. So in other words, <laughs> nice. they get to move double oh. their speed as a reaction. Uh, like, whenever you, you cash that. all them. allies? Oh, boy. Within Ninja 30 dash. feet. All allies within 30 feet. <laughs> As in, you're so fast, we can't oh, even see you. Thank you, Space Colonizer. Yeah. Uh, Tracy, you get a pull as well? Ha. Do you have the uh, pull from between? I give five diamonds. Okay. Oh. Diamonds of fives. <laughs> diamonds of gems. Five, five of diamonds. diamonds. You're immune to 10 points of piercing damage. Yeah. We're, guys, we're like never going to die. Yeah. So. I, would, I would not say these things to the DM. <laughs> hey, we haven't started yet, have we? Uh, no. He was being very generous. This makes me think uh, fate is being generous, so I think uh, there's a harsh, oh, harsh will. Oh, yep, there is always a balance. All right, so uh, as I mentioned. Wait, Tyler gets on. Hmm? No. no. Only for the ladies. No. Oh, all the ladies! All the ladies. Oh, all the ladies. You know what? I feel like we're a little bit like Danger 5 over here. We are. Because it's very oh. international. Yeah. True. Who's yeah. who's the smoker? Me. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I would say the French one, maybe. <laughs> okay, so you stand yeah. atop this waterfall, or or next to this waterfall, uh, surveying the swamp in front of you. Mm. I do not um, like it. 
<laughs> you have this crudely drawn map. Maybe, maybe drawn in a matter of 15 or 20 minutes and then quickly photoshopped <laughs> by a lizard man who you encountered in the swamp. Um, it's putrid. And you have uh, <laughs> essentially two immediate choices. You can follow kind of this uh, rather well-worn path that slopes down to uh, the village on the south side of the map, or you can follow the narrow hunting trail that goes up into the, into the area known as the Fangmire. I have a suggestion. If mm. I may, yes. I always trust my father's blade. So I will flip it into the air in the direction it points. Uh. Is the way we will take. Are we in agreement? Nah. I don't know. Tee. Yeah, baby. Here I go. Seems I, a little simplistic. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, the simple ways are the best. Hiya. What? You didn't say what? Well, it, it was? fell off a cliff. Oh yes. Uh, <laughs> I think we're screwed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So my my sword goes. Shame to... point. Uh. Oh. Hey guys, I have another idea. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> My sword goes flying off the end of the water. You have to roll a two or higher to stay in the game right now. A two or higher to stay. You have two shame points, yes? Oh this is boy. a pretty reliable die, so I'm going to go uh -huh. with this one. Oh! oh. 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 Yeah. Reliable. Wait, you mentioned but it still healing made potions. It. How many healing potions do we have? Well, I did not mention any healing potions. You said potions. you got some from the lizard man. No. We gave the lizard man for spells. healing spells. Oh, we yeah. gave yeah. In exchange for the beautiful map which you have before you. <laughs> Okay. Which is okay. quite colorful. Okay, great. Uh, oh. Okay, so your sword says what? It is falling down this waterfall. I say we. Oh, it's okay. I have another one right here. Okay. <laughs> it is a shitty sword. Okay. All right, so let's try that again. You said it was your if father's blade. <laughs> <laughs> he had several blades. <laughs> this happens frequently. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. I have more. Uh, so if it is this side of the card, I say we go down the hunter's trail. The other side, we go down the well worn path. Okay. 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 Okay, I don't know how well this is going to work. But. Yeah, didn't yeah. you? <laughs> what side is it, DM? <laughs> okay. So, so I don't remember. You <laughs> <laughs> we should just, write this down first before we flip it. <laughs> wait, wait, before we do anything, I have another idea. I don't know, let's <laughs> flip one more time. <laughs> The hunter's path, it tells me. Yeah, baby. Can I touch your hair? Let's spend the next ten Great. minutes holding no, his not. sword. <laughs> touch it anyway. No, no, no. I think that would be a good That's use of our time. Point of order, uh, the uh, the side with a face on it was to go down to the village. The side with the blank side was to go <laughs> on the <laughs> hunter's <laughs> path. Am I right, Chad? Yes. Am I right? That's right. So, so yeah. where are we well, going? Someone's paying attention. Uh, by the way, uh, I don't know who donated this, but Tyler gets a free reroll yeah. for his spot on Sean impersonation. Yes! yes. Yeah. Thank you. BSB Care? Yep. BSB Care, you're my favorite. You always have been. Yeah. I'm sorry, Don. We got rerolls. So right? We got rerolls. Yeah. yeah. One. We are. Uh, Okay. All right, we are rocking and rolling. So, uh, so wait, which one did we choose? So good brand. We should probably go to the village if it landed on. Okay, yes. all right, the village. Very good, the village. So I, I start marching off towards the village. As I said, the village. Village. The village. Village. The village. Okay. <laughs> we will see some villages. Villages. Okay. <clears throat> um, you guys march down the hill. Yes. I, I take the lead. Oh. It's March. I dropped a card. And I start uh, probably talking at length of everything I know. Uh, it's probably part of stuff about this guy, Raka Pfeiffer's. Uh, okay. Thing. Just boring, you guys. Because I have a high intelligence. Okay. Oh, mm. All right. You follow, um, you follow the path. Um, another thing about him. Wild magic. Who knows? <coughs> it's, it's, it's uh, as I mentioned, it's, it's, it's well trodden. Um, and you can see the village as you approach within. Look, there it is! Uh, <laughs> as, as, you, as you come through the trees, it is heavily wooded here. Um, so uh, you come through the trees and spot the village ahead, and it looks very ramshackle. Uh, the uh, huts are very crude, uh, straw roof, like with matted with <laughs> mud. Um. <laughs> yeah. It's a okay. putrid village. Wow, I like this wind. I like wind could blow this Everybody over. Everybody give me a perception check, please. Of course. I'm going to roll with stop. Perception. Ooh, Look at that over there. Ooh, I'm okay with this. Wait. That's right, sorry. 18. Wisdom saves. I know threat to you. Six. Wow. 10. Okay, so Five. 18 was our highest. I got a 10. Yes. See, or nine. I see everything. 11. 
<laughs> okay. Um, you you managed to pick out, and it's it's difficult to do this, but you managed to pick out a, a very short squat figure. What the fuck? In robes, <laughs> like, wearing a kind of like a tattered uh, brown uh, cloak and robe, who looks like he was like maybe picking berries or something like that. Um, and he turns and sees you, and then he kind of. It's weird because he gets down on all fours and he runs off towards the village. Okay. Okay. But okay. he was walking on two legs, like you saw him picking berries, um, okay. you know, off, off, picking something off of the bushes and putting them in a little basket. And then when he sees you, he just kind of gets down on all fours and, and runs off okay. towards the village. Um, I say, I say, what the fuck? <laughs> a tiny man turned into a squirrel. <laughs> oh, a druid. What? He, he was he was two legged and then he was quattro legged. <laughs> Foul sorcery. Quattro, that means four. <laughs> and he was taking shit from the barrel. <laughs> he was picking the shit. Undoubtedly some sort picking of picking the shit, baby. <laughs> Same shifty right monster. There. He was right there, I swear to D. Why are you eating? See if it tastes good, baby. <laughs> okay, yeah. No, no. I'm gonna go explore the berries. All right. Uh, as you walk towards the basket, you're looking down to pick it up, and all of a sudden you see a pair of black boots step right in front of you, right next to the basket. And as you look up to see who it is, you recognize Tiger. <gasps> oh, it's Tiger. Tiger. It's Tiger, baby. Tiger, I never can. I never remember if you're here or not. <laughs> you, know, you always just kind of show up. I am. Not of this world. <laughs> I belong to a different plane. Keanu, the Matrix? <laughs> the plane of Parky's Brigade. Yeah. <laughs> and yet, I have been summoned here yeah. to perform a task. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Are you ready? Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah baby. Then draw your fate. Oh, yay! Oh, boy. No, it's a bad one? Yes, I'm here to screw all of you! Oh. Yes! Oh, Tiger! No. Tiger! I oh, wrote no. you a song! Uh oh, I got a bad one. I did oh, too. something stinks in the air. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, boy. Man! <laughs> That's what you get for yes. saying we're invincible. I know. No, how did okay. you get a good one? I got. Well, I didn't. What do you? How did you get about? a good one? Yeah, how did she get a good one? <laughs> Holy crap! Magic trick! <laughs> oh, sorcery! Uh, the I'll, one minute magic trick! How take his head off? I'll allow it. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, six oh, of tiger. hearts. You can add one d six to one attack roll that an ally makes. <laughs> Freaking tiger. That one one d six to an attack roll. Yep. Okay. Thought I went through these. <coughs> wow. Virva, oh, what did yeah. you get? Tiger. Oh, the Jack of Spades. I'm sure that's going to be fine. You are at disadvantage on all damage rolls. All? Oh. For how, how long? Ooh. All, all the whole game. Okay. Wait. <laughs> I need some more dice. Dungeon oh. Bastard. <laughs> <laughs> the bad ones are worse than the good ones. <laughs> I mean, the bad ones are worse than like good ones are the good. good, yeah. Wait, what? Uh, the bad, the bad are worse. Are Say the game. worse than Come the good on, ones. If we're on a number line, okay. the oh. negatives go farther than the positives. Oh, let's see. Okay. That's good. I got think? the uh, the king of of clubs. The king of clubs. Backfired All right. on me. Uh, I am going to save that because at some point, oh. an enemy within 30 feet of you is going to be healed six die six hit points. Excellent. Wow. Okay. That, that is excellent all... for me. I will remind you of that. that is yeah, sure. you will. If you don't, it's like five shame points. <laughs> oh. Tracy. Six of clubs. Six of clubs. <laughs> My favorite. You must physically hold your nose oh, for the God. next oh. 10 minutes. Ah! I'll set a timer. Right now, starting now. Starting now. I'll set a timer. That's weird. But I agree. This village has a strange and stinky odor about it. Mm -hmm. uh, ten of clubs. Ten of clubs. Batons. Hey, baby. Uh, so your things have been here. by 20 feet. <laughs> oh, I've stepped upon a snail shell. <laughs> I it's gonna go by big. 20, go. 20 feet? 20, by 20 feet, yeah. <laughs> I've stepped with, well, I'll take another step and, oh, my other foot! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so I believe you have a 10 foot speed now. Yeah, Am I that's, right about that? That is, that's I'm, I'm army crawling now. Yeah. The whole crew ever? For the rest of tonight? Hmm? Yeah. 
back. All right, uh, so uh, so Gudbrand drops to the ground, both feet injured, and he's just, just gonna he's yeah, army crawling army along. Crawl along. Oh, oh my God, you guys! Wait, I oh, shouldn't wow. have thrown away my father's yeah. sword. I'm so sorry, Dad. Tiger. <laughs> Ugh, you know oh, what? That was brutal. I, I wrote a real nice song about you that might have to change in the next ne- like five minutes. <laughs> oh man, You're, that's true. Yeah, that song is not very so. Are we playing that before the intro? Stinks. What are we going to do with that? Uh, after the break. Somebody after the stepped break. in some was, fucking dragon shit. Time. <laughs> all right. Okay, this so is not good, so, baby. So this guy like in black boots, he curses all of us. Oh, it's it's the it's tiger. tiger. Yeah. Oh, he's and here. He's, yeah, he's here, and his abs are just kind of like shining and rippling. Can we murder the tiger? And, and he's like, this does no, not seem like a good idea. Sometimes. My work is done. Oh, now. And then he walks I, behind a tree and a, just disappears. I chase him behind the tree. Crotch chop. Yeah. Crotch chop. Oh, I like yeah, the crotch chop. Cool. Yeah. Mm. Um. So you know. do we all see him, or was that just the monk season? Well, he cursed us all. But that could be ethereal. I think I was the only one with a perception check. No, yeah, that I, was no, to he, capture the... He definitely the, addressed the all guy. of you. Oh, you okay. all okay, saw him. Saw yeah. yeah. The initial perception check was to see whatever this... The one they said, what's that? The little the tiny... Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. Wait, I want to do a knowledge nature to see if I know what that is. Knowledge nature... Uh, stop. All right, this will be nice and distracting. Um, while we're... Not great. Hey, with a nine nature check, do I know what that critter was? With a nine nature check? No. Critter? Come on! <laughs> Come on, killer DM! <laughs> yes, that's right. Uh, I've got yeah, the timer I guess we're on just gonna Tracy. do this. <laughs> <laughs> like, doing great. Uh, I'm all right. I'm all right. We're gonna do this the old-fashioned way. Uh, pick a character. Pick a miniature for your oh, character. Yeah. Oh yeah, right. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. Normally, we have beautifully painted miniatures from. Iron Tusk. Iron Tusk! That we use in our game. Um, but this is know. sort of a one shot, short term, no, no shot. Maybe, you know, if we keep up with God Smite, yeah. we'll have our own set of God Smite miniatures that we will uh, put together. <clears throat> so, the best. Flashback oh, to some movie. really awesomely <laughs> painted miniatures. <laughs> uh, yeah, and then let's get some, some battle. Yeah. We'll, we'll have to deal with that in a minute. Okay, so uh, you saw this guy, this creature scurrying around in the woods just outside the village. Uh, you were approached by Tiger, who apparently has. <laughs> Is that his theme song? <laughs> no. <laughs> that's that's his uh, oh, that's, that's, that's his musical sting. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody that's short and sexy. That's me. Um, <laughs> all right. Oh, so that's me. Uh, what are you guys mm-hmm. doing? They're cool. In the village? Well, yeah, I thought in the village. Um, no, no, like you're you're still standing in the woods oh, outside oh, the village. Right, oh. right. So as I said, you can see that the, it, it looks like very crudely oh. assembled mud huts, um, like very kind of basic levels of architecture going on here. Certainly it's there's not no a like pool. brick right. and mortar. <laughs> uh, it doesn't look like there's any even like cut timber or anything like that. It literally looks like huts assembled out of like sticks and straw and mud and stuff like that. Can anyone help me to tell me what these berries are? That is clearly what we should be doing right now. Yes! Let me see if I can help you identify these berries. I army crawl over to you. Throw them down to me! (laughs) (laughs) All right. I cannot see. Chat, what did I roll? A 10. Okay, four, a total of 14. Yes, because I had... uh, 14 for nature? Yes, 14. All right. Um, they look like wild raspberries. I believe they might be wild raspberries. <laughs> we can make so red. We baby. can make a wonderful wine out of these. Oh, I, I kind of want to take the basket full of them. And open a winery. Well, after we do other stuff <laughs> that our god wants us to do. Did that creature go in the direction of the village? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Let's take them with us. Yeah. The raspberries. Put them on my back. Uh, just. The basket, oh, okay, and I'll just yeah. crawl along. Gonna, it's, it'll be your well, perhaps shot. we should go into this village and walk around and maybe look in the huts of something. For Am something. I the only one that is not obsessed with the berries? Let, let's see if we know anyone who knows where Raka might be. Everyone, follow me! I'm giving you inspiration for actually having an authentic accent I buy. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? You haven't met my cousin's grandmother's aunt. <laughs> Legit. <laughs> <laughs>